Merry Christmas world! It's December time and that means a couple of things. Time to spend your whole year savings for a whole 10 minutes of unwrapping presents. Time to buy the wrong size clothes for people who end up returning it the next day. And time for the talent show with Regina George and her evil band of loyal followers. Hey guys, Brett here, giving you the tips and strategies for selling for more, buying for less, and creating financial wealth through real estate. This is my favorite time of the year. For me, it's the one time that my schedule slows down enough to go back home to Michigan and share it with my family. And of course, Santa is in town, ladies. I want to tell you a quick story about Christmas when I was 12 years old. My parents came up with the idea to force us to go to a retirement home and sing to the elderly. I had two problems with this. The first thing, I'm a horrible singer. Even worse than that, I'm terrible at talking to old people. Alright, so Christmas Eve rolls around and we show up to sing. I remember the first room we walked into and there's just two little old ladies sitting there looking at us so funny. I promise still to this day, the lady was staring at me dead in the eyes with the funniest look. I wanted so badly just to run out of there and get going. After 30 seconds or so of us singing the first Noel, I saw their eyes begin to tear up. By the end, they were sobbing and I, I really couldn't understand why. After the song finished, the lady pulled us aside and described why it meant so much to her. She didn't have a family around. There was no one there to visit her for the holidays and, and even worse, it wasn't just for Christmas, it was, it was all year round that she didn't have visitors. Sometimes we take for granted all the blessings that we have. It wasn't until that point that I realized not everyone has an amazing family like I do. Not everyone has somebody to talk to and some people have experienced so much loss and so much pain that they don't even have anything to look forward to when they wake up. I never realized that even for a couple of minutes, singing a silly Christmas song could be the highlight of somebody's ear. Ever since then, we have continued with that family tradition. I'm still not good at singing, still really bad with talking to old people, but I look forward to going. I hope everyone is able to enjoy the joys of being together as a family. Take the picture! Where are we looking? Okay, maybe it's not always perfect. For a lot of my clients, this will be your first Christmas in your new home. I am so grateful that I got to help you and be a part of your little story. Remember, the reason for this season, this is the time to get together as family, be happy and enjoy some time together. So for everyone, God bless and Merry Christmas. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bell swing and jingle bells ring. Snowing and blowing up bushels of fun. Now the jingle hop has begun.